Hello everyone, my name is Antal Siddiqui and today I'm going to give you a walkthrough of my photo sharing app. So the first thing that we can do is log in to the photo sharing app. The first thing we see is this extended user display. We see these new fields that show the latest photo that's uploaded and the photo with the highest number of comments on it. And if we click on either one of these, we'll be presented with the particular view for this photo. And the cool thing about this section is that it dynamically updates. So let's say we upload a new photo. We'll see it updated right over here. Our activities feed, which we can get to by clicking this guy, shows us the five most recent activities that have been going on in our app. And we can see some of them have associated thumbnails that reflect the photo they have to do with. Now, if we want this to be as updated as possible, we can actually click the refresh button over here. See that in action? We'll upload another photo. We click the refresh button, we'll see that activity coming through. Now we can also favorite photos. So let's say there's a photo that we really like, we can click the favorite button. And once we've done that, if we go to our favorite photos view, we can see a collection of all of our favorite photos. And we can click on any one of them to have it pop up and see that photo in its full glory. But let's say that one of these photos, it just stops sparking joy for us. We can actually get rid of it really easily by clicking this guy over here. And it's gone from our view. We can also like photos. So let's say I really like BB-8. I really like this photo of BB-8. I can unlike the photo. I can like the photo and we see the like count changing dynamically. The cool part about this is that, as you can see here, these photos are arranged in order by their number of likes. We can even do deletions. So let's say I really just want to profess to BB-8 how much I love him. So I say, I love you, BB-8. You submit that comment. Then we start feeling some second thoughts, some doubts. Maybe it's too soon to tell BB-8 that we love them. So we can actually delete the comment if we own it. And let's say we're feeling a lot of shame. We can actually even delete the photo entirely. And this is all happening and reflected in the app immediately in real time. But let's say just we're feeling way too much shame. Like we just can't bear it anymore. We can actually delete our account entirely. We'll get a warning, but we gotta get out of here. We say delete, we'll be logged out immediately. And if we log in with another user, say this one over here, we'll see that that Ray Kenobi account is totally gone. We go to the activities feed, nothing about Ray Kenobi is even popping up anymore. It's as if that user never existed because they had to get out of there. And that is all. Thank you so much.